15th edition of Lakme Fashion Week in India's showbiz capital Mumbai saw designers presenting their collection infused with social messages. Keeping a match with the tradition of India's most popular sartorial fistas, the second day saw seasoned designers like Raghavendra Rathore, Gaurav Shah, Shruti Sancheti and Anavali Mishra showcasing their designs followed by young designers. Steeped in Indian aesthetics, designer Gaurav Shah's collection titled Kalpa Viksha comprised of heavy Indian embroidery on layered and voluminous ethnic outfits. Bollywood actors with their balan dressed in a pink and golden sari walked the runway for Gaurav. Meanwhile, Shruti Sancheti's collection Nomadistan, portrayed vibrancy of intense dazzling colors such as yellow, orange and crimson combined with flowing skirts and flared sarees. Amid the monochromatic and vivid ranges of colors used in the outfits, what stood out in Shruti's collection was the effort to spread social messages prevalent in the current Indian scenario. Since the world is looking towards India, if you see all the international collections, people are putting, you know, Indian, uh, I mean, the Burberry show or the Gautier show, I mean, obviously, so they're all putting Indian crafts. It's time that the Indian designers start, you know, using their legacy rather than just blindly aping the West. And this is what we've tried to do, that Indian clothes shouldn't be just limited to, you know, Indian silhouettes only. They can be worn in a global manner. The in soul can be Indian, but the styling can be very contemporary, very global, and that is what I've done. While vibrant colors dominated the ram, designer Anavila Mishra used pastel shades for his collection. Bollywood diva Diya Mirza turned showstopper for Anavila. The theme for the collection this time was a summer stroll. Uh, it's basically uh, about the balance that we are looking in our everyday modern city lives, where we uh, live in a concrete jungle, but we still try to make it beautiful with putting plants, or doing some little terrace gardens, getting uh, flowers into our uh, living rooms. That was the whole idea. You know, from where we've reached today, we can't go back uh, living into the jungles. And if we keep on growing the way we are growing, uh, by making concrete all around us, that's also not going to lead us somewhere. So where we are, we, we right now need to pause and start creating a balance. Well, it was indeed a great show from ANIS Mumbai Bureau.